First, I would just like to quote from Frederick Douglass. It is easier to build strong children than to repair broken men. And so we have built, built the infrastructure projects, but I think it's about time also to look at building our future generation, and that's our children. And so my question is on the Juvenile Justice Welfare Act. Now this question is regarding the children in conflict with the law. How will you address the problem of children, even younger than nine years old, being used as scapegoats in the commission of grave or serious crimes, considering that we are signatory to the United Nations Convention on the Rights of the Child. I agree uh, na hindi dapat binababaan ang age of criminal responsibility. I disagree na dapat parusahan ang mga magulang. Tandaan natin ang krimen sa, na dito sa, sa baba ng ating lipunan sa mga mahirap ay dahil sa social problems na kriniate ng ating lipunan. And I also agree na dapat bigyan natin ng tamang value sa mga kabataan. Dapat tinuturo sa school na ba masama ang extrajudicial killing, masama ang red tagging, masama si Marcos, ang marami siyang human rights violation. I disagree. Nung panahon... Okay. Ang FBA, we, uh, I, 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 20 seconds left before dapat, you were interrupted. Dapat tinuturuan natin ang kabataan na respetuhin ang buhay, ang human rights, respetuhin ang buhay ng lahat at hindi dapat pumapatay ang ating mga gobyerno. At hindi nagnanakaw ang ating gobyerno. Diyan tayo magkakaroon ng mga mabuting henerasyon ng kabataan. Thank you. At, Attorney Gadon, you have 45 minutes for your interpolation. Yes. Yes, Attorney Gadon, you, you may... Now interpolate with Attorney Espiritu. 45 seconds. Yeah. Uh, palagi na lang pinopoint out niya. Palagi nilang sinasabi yung, uh, yung uh, human rights violations ni Marcos. Eh, unang-una, sino ba ang nagpapatay dun sa mga NPA na gustong sumirender? Eh, di ba si Joma? Oh. Eh, bakit ninyo sa insane si Marcos? Attorney Espiritu, you have 30 seconds sino for your Sino ba ang bumamba sa Plaza Miranda? Yes. Ha? Sila Joma. I'll go, I'll go by the Bakit record. Bakit yung iisisi kay Marcos yun? It's my time. Uh, this is, time. We should not use He's this time. forum for a propaganda against the Marcoses. It was, it was intended. Atter yes. Attorney Gadon, your 45 seconds is over. We have 30 seconds for Attorney Espiritus. Rebuttal. Binuksan mo ang usapan, huwag mo akong pagbawalan. I go by the record, Amnesty International, 3,257 ang pinatay nung panahon ni Marcos. 35,000 ang mga... It's my time, huwag kang bastos. It's my time. 35,000. 35,000 ang tinorture. 70,000 ang kinulong. It's a matter of record. Thank you. 30 seconds for rebuttal. No nagkaroon ng aso sa Hawaii, yung 10,000 human rights victims, nung in-implement nila dito yung nag-file sila ng petition sa, sa uh, RTC, wala silang naipresent ang ebidensya. Pagdating sa Court of Appeals, wala rin. So asan yung sinasabi nila yung human rights violations? Uh, we have Dismissed yung kaso. We have interpolation from Attorney Roque. That would be 45 seconds. Kung ano man ang nangyari sa nakaraan, inisa-isa ko po ang records Wala pong kaso for human rights violations sa Amerika si Ferdinand Marcos Jr. Inisa-isa ko rin po ang mga kaso na decided, decided po ng ating Philippine Supreme Court. Totoo po, co-administrator si Ferdinand Bobo Marcos, wala pong kaso na siya mismo nagnakaw. Can I have... Attorney Espiritu has 30 seconds for a rebuttal and we have a question again yes. from Dr. Thank you. With all... You have you have the time. You uh, have the opportunity, Attorney Spirito, for a thirty second. My my microphone is yes. being uh, silenced all the time when I do my rebuttal. Can I be able to continue yes, without attorney. my microphone being turned off? Yes, Attorney Spirito. Okay, with all due respect uh, to uh, Attorney Harry Roque, I know your history. You were anti-Marcos before. 
You were for human rights before. Your life, you spent your life against the Marcoses, you work for human rights, and now that you were given a Senate's pack under the party of Bongbong Marcos, now you cry hallelujah and praise Marcos. Okay. Thank you, Attorney Espiritu. We, since you alluded to Attorney Rocky, we will give him 30 seconds for a rebuttal. And your, just for the information of our candidates, your microphones will be silenced when others still have time. So that's something that they do to give others opportunity to speak. So Attorney Rocky, since you have been alluded to, you have 30 seconds for a rebuttal. There was nothing respectful with what you said against me. Ang katotohanan po ang pinag-uusapan, hindi po ang patay na Marcos, ang pinag-uusapan ang buhay na Marcos. Sa akin po, panagutin ang mga nagkasala, pero yung mga hindi po gumawa ng kahit anong kasalanan, wag po natin idamay sa sise. Yun lang po.